This video is about improving sound and string engagement through counter pressure. There are a couple of ways that we can find counter pressure in our playing. And one, as I have mentioned in a, in a video earlier, is to have the, the cello lying a little bit higher on one's chest so it's not too low down. In essence, we're bringing the cello higher to meet the bow or create counter pressure, pressure against the bow. Another way of creating counter pressure is to turn the cello a little bit to one side or the other. So when we're playing on the A string, we, we can turn our cello a little bit to the right, which means that the A string is just a little bit higher, bringing it closer again to the bow, thus creating counter pressure. We can do the same on the C string if we want to have more engagement and a better sound on the C string. If we turn the cello a little bit to the left, the C string becomes higher and reaches up higher towards our bow, again creating counter pressure. So if I play without doing that, you can hear that when I make those little changes, it can really, really help the sound. with the cello a bit more turned. <laughs> <laughs> 